Hi, welcome to Frontneck Outfitters Canoe and Kayak Center. This is a canoe video review of H2O's Horizon 17. The Horizon 17 is the largest boat in the three boat series that also includes the mid-sized Paramount 16.6 and the smaller Edge 16. What is a modern asymmetrical boat? Exactly that. It's asymmetrical in shape. So where most canoes are symmetrical in shape, meaning same shape bow to stern, asymmetrical boats are actually designed to have a little longer, narrower front. Your widest point is actually about four inches after aft of center. They tend to be keelless. They tend to have a keelless shallow arch hull, which you can see this does have. And very sharp entries and exits. And a low shear line. A low shear line means that it's less affected by the wind. It doesn't have that big recurve stem that you would see on so many traditional or heritage style boats. So it's designed for efficiency. Really with two paddler types in mind. It's designed for the wilderness tripper who needs extended gear storage to really get out and go and wants a boat that's going to perform and respond to their more experienced skill set. It's also designed to be user friendly enough for a more novice paddler who wants to learn, who is going to improve their skills long term. Very fast, able to handle big water situations very, very well. The Horizon 17 doesn't paddle like a big boat. It's uh, a very nimble, very maneuverable, very responsive boat. Again, something that that more still skilled paddler is going to look for. It's uh, the fastest boat in the three boat series and actually it's the most efficient boat that, that H2O builds, period. It doesn't just stop with its great performance, it also has absolutely stunning looks. H2O Canoe Company is Canadian, they're Ontario made in Tavistock, Ontario and you can see their build technology is simply light years ahead of the rest of the pack. This particular boat is the helium lamp, so it has a clear black carbon upper, it has a Kevlar bottom. The, we use, uh, they use an epoxy resin, epoxy is 10 times more expensive than cheaper polyester resins, which a lot of companies use. You can't see it, you can't feel it, but simply put, it builds a much stronger boat. You can see the diamond shaped core that H2O incorporates into all of the boats. And what that does is it tends to distribute stress or loads or when you hit that rock or whatever it is under, underneath the water throughout the length of the hull. So in short, again, it makes a stronger boat. And that's done in all their layups. This particular boat incorporates the ICG gunnel system and that's a thin aluminum outer gunnel it has a carbon Kevlar foam core inner gunnel that's 50% stronger, 50% lighter, 50% um, stiffer than the traditional gunnel. You can see the unique, at least I hope you can, five finger grip on the boat. The entire interior on the helium lamp is done in black cherry, canted, that means you're sloped, uh, black cherry seats and you can see they're slung from the inside. That eliminates sway for larger paddlers. Obviously a deep dish portage show. And at Frontenac Outfitters, uh, a kneeling fork comes standard in all the H2O boats. Something else that's really cool that they've done, if they provided instant access into the flotation tanks to provide both dry storage, and access should one have to do a repair. Just a wonderful, well thought idea that nobody else is doing. The H2O Horizon is also available in three other layups. The next layup um, down cost-wise is called their Super Light. And they're easy to tell. The helium boats all have the black upper. The, the Super Light boats all have a white bottom. And they're going to weigh about five pounds less uh, excuse me, five pounds more, but they're going to be uh, about five or six hundred dollars less than. They also do a premium Kevlar as well. Um, premium Kevlar and then a premium fiberglass boat. What premium means for fiberglass and Kevlar is that all their boats 
are made with what we call infusion. So with a standard boat would be made with a hand layup. Uh, then people got into what they called vacuum bag and they put a bag in and around the boat. They retract the air from the bag, squashes the materials together. H2O now uses an infusion process for all their boat designs. And that simply means they have a male and female mold squashed together, squashing together, uh, resins of binder, anything else migrates up out of the boat, but you get a very consistent 100% epoxy resin layup throughout the entire boat. So the Helium series is made with epoxy. All their other boats are made with a vinyl ester. So their build technology is some of the best in the world. If you'd like to purchase or test paddle one of these, we'd love you to have you come down and see us. We're Frontneck Outfitters Canoe and Kayak Center, and you can test paddle these six days a week, anytime, any day. Come paddle with us. Thank you.